Hello and welcome to episode 19 of the Data Pack tutorial series for version 1.21 and higher. We're going to have advancements that expand the world border. So I don't think we need an intro, let's, but let's set a world border. World border set 10. I think it's already centered on me. It is indeed. Okay, so the idea is whatever advancements can detect, when we get an advancement, the world border is going to expand a little bit and let us do more stuff. This is based on an old uh, map um, by the Farlanders, or the Farlands. Um, Captive Minecraft, it was called. I did one called Rise of Atlantis, link in the description, although I warn you it's only 12 episodes because the map broke. And it's 10 years ago, so I sound rather boring. <laughs> anyway, or, or there's a new one called Hoard. Border hoarder. I'll put links in the description. You have a look. So we get, what we're going to do is we're going to eat a carrot and the border is going to expand a bit. And then we're going to mine a diamond or something and the border will expand a bit. That's the premise. Let's get on. I think the first thing to do would be to make our advancements. So let's pop over to Missode. That's not Missode. Oh, well, we can make the advancement folder. So in our namespace, new folder. Advancement. We have an advancement folder. Okay, let's pop over to Missode. So first one was going to be eating a carrot, wasn't it? So requirement, location, no. Uh, consume item, there we go. Conditions, item, carrot. And our reward will be, we'll run a function called IDYT, my namespace, and expand border. That sort of make, makes sense. And let's save that. Copy. Let's go back to our VS Code and we'll make a new file in advancement. What's this one called? Eat carrot. Let's make sure we spell things correctly. Eat carrot. Yeah, it's a JSON. Let's paste that in there. Okay, you're not going to be happy because expand border doesn't exist. So in our function, folder we will create a new file and we'll call that expand border okay leave it empty for now eat carrot expand border that's happy now cool let's make another one back to misode and we're going to change that from consume item and we'll change it to inventory changed Inventory changed, and we'll just say conditions, items, diamond. That'll do. It's keeping the same function as a reward. Copy that. Back to VS Code. New file in advancement. Get diamond. Okay. All seems good so far. We've got two advancements. And we'll expand the border. Let's just uh, say hi. Let's go and give it a test. Off we go. Let's do a reload. Uh, let's, let's, I don't think we have to be in survival, but just in case for eating this. I can't eat it. Oh dear me. Effect give me instant damage 1-1. One, one. Could, can you take away a bit of my saturation, please? Do I have to jump around a bit first? Jump around, jump around, jump around. Well, let's just eat the diamond. We well, can't eat the diamond. Let's just pick up the diamond, because that'll get me one. Ah, it said hi. Okay. How do I get my... Oh, my saturation's gone down. Cool. Well, we'll save that. So, one worked. That wasn't a problem. Let's eat the carrot now. And that said hi as well. Now, we're not revoking the advancements, so... We're not going to keep saying hi each time we pick up a diamond and we pick it up again. Nothing. We've already got it. Okay. So we've got a basic concept working. Let's go back. And let's do... Well, let's do a reset because I've still got those um, advancements. So in function, I'm just going to make myself a reset. Actually, I'm going to make myself a set border first. No, we'll just stick with a reset. It's easier. Let's have less files. Reset. And in here, I'm going to have advancement, revoke, the player, 
only not adventuring time no 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 eat carrot and we'll reset get diamond and we'll also do world border center on me and we'll also do world border set 10. Okay, now we can reset everything. And let's do the expand border. Let's let's do say uh, the border is expanding and world border add. Uh, let's add, I don't know, five. So we can definitely see it happening. And let's say it takes five. I think that's seconds, five seconds. Okay, so we eat a carrot or get the diamond. That will run expand border. Expand border will add five to the current border size and it will take five seconds to do it. And we've got a reset. Okay. That's not Minecraft. There we go. Right. So let's let's move back this way a bit. And we will run our function to reset. So this is let's say let's pretend we start here. Well I've already got one, haven't I? Because Let's put the diamond back. Put the diamond in there. There we go. Let's go over here and do the reset. That's why it's handy to have things like a reset. Okay. So here I am. Uh, let's say I farm a carrot. I can't get the diamond yet. So I farm a carrot and I eat it. My border expands. Ooh, ah, now the chest is free. Now I can do something here. Let's get that. And the border is expanding again. There we go. Okay. Like I said, this is based on the Captive Minecraft series or the Border Hoarder, which is a new one. Uh, have a look at those links in the description if you're interested in them. Um, I, you can watch my playthrough if you want of Captive Minecraft. Like I said, it's 12 episodes long because the, because the map broke, <laughs> which is a good advertisement for it, isn't it? And I sound rather bored, to be honest. It's 10 years ago, so... I, you know what it's like when you listen to yourself from 10 years ago. Sounds awful. Well, maybe you don't. If you're about 16, you're probably not listening to yourself when you're six. I am waffling. There we go. We're done. Take care of yourself. Have a nice day. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.